This morning I was meditating at seven o'clock. Was thinking, what is the person I want to work with? What is the woman I want to work with this year? You know, in marketing they call it avatar. It always seems a little bit like intergalactic being. But basically a woman I want to work and help and serve. And I was just writing the list. This is the list I was writing. And it's like, you know, woman, talented, gifted, and um, she's a giver, volunteer, spiritual, business orientated. And as I was really going closer and closer into my heart, who is she? Three major things hit me. Really, it hit my heart and I have three major topics which I realized so many women are struggling with. So let me read it to you. It's she, she knows she deserves better, but she's afraid to ask for it. She needs better health to keep up with her young children, but she's afraid to ask for help. She needs better health and excuse me, she needs better wealth to leave her toxic relationship and she's scared to act. When I wrote this, this is kind of a channeling which I got from universe or from a source. As you, It shook my whole being because so many women, my clients in my coaching practice are amazing business driven, really high active women and secretly yet they have they suffer from low self-esteem they feel that they are not good enough and outside you know you would not know because the facade is so beautifully put together they might be really high achievers but deep down when they go home when they take their makeup off and they take their business clothes off and they put their other clothes on the you know, the cozy, homey clothes, they started to compare, they feel not good enough, and um, and they stay in relationships which are not good for them, which are putting their creativity or their amazing talents down. And, excuse me, and that really breaks my heart because it's 21st century, we just entered a new era, 2020 is a beautiful catalyst and this year we have the chance to really make the best providing that every single day you make tiny steps tiny steps to work on your belief like you know self-esteem is such a big word but what it actually means is that when you look in the mirror instead of seeing all the wrinkles or someone who is not good enough you see like I love you I love you. You are great. And I'm so grateful that today I have the chance to make something because many people die. Thousands of thousands of people die every single day. So if you woke up today, you are one of the blessed people. If you're going to wake up tomorrow morning, even if you have no money, you are still a blessed person. If you have roof over your head, if you have water to drink and a food to eat and a warm bed and a blanket to put over yourself you are a blessed person abundant person so all this comparison and staying in toxic relationships not good not eating well or even having a very poor mindset about money it's all here and how to change it is to really change your frequency until recently, I always studied, I'm always a learner. I study every day, I watch certain things and uh, uh, listen to Delta Waves, to Power On Audio Club, which is a, an amazing daily audio hypnosis. Yesterday I was watching about chakras and how the universe operates on seven laws, but actually it's one law, universal law. And when you walk into a room or in a life, you just see me, right? You see a woman with blonde hair, what face. But actually what's happening, that I am constantly 
it's like evaporating a frequency. It's called, it's like a big octopus. Yeah. And you're walking through the street and you see faces and bodies, but actually if you would put different glasses, you would see just little energies going and these energies, this is what the universe listens to. This is the frequency and mind and head. If they are together, if they are working together, you talk the universal universal language the language of frequency if you operate on lower frequency which is fear jealousy comparing not good enough um, I don't talk about vaccines I stay out of it but that comes into that category you're going to attract and if you're going to stay in the people who, around you who are fearful and don't really appreciate you, you're going to build that low vibration. And this is what universe is going to send you back. A low vibration, diseases, um, crisis, uh, divorces, you know, so uh, and wishing and hoping and praying and expecting what many people say, I wish I have a better ha health. I want a better partner. This is just an empty talk unless you change your vibration. So I'm um, a coach, a life coach, um, mindset coach, confidence coach, basically a person who helps other people to, to step from the smallness into greatness. If you resonate with me, you are very happy. I'm very happy that you can work with me. You can have a private coaching. If you do not resonate with me and you resonate with somebody else, please, please do find somebody who can change your life, who can show you tools to do it. I have here, oh, sorry. So I have some, uh, men giving me compliments but i don't really particularly like it here because it's a really serious talk i want to talk about changing your life if you're waiting for something to change and you do nothing about it nothing will happen i'm walking and talking my my life is just i'm a coach who walks the talk i've been through it and what I'm sharing with my friends and family and my clients is exactly how I have succeeded from very low self-esteem on outside. I was successful, but inside I had a, I was shy and I had a low self-esteem and I changed that. I transformed that and it can be done. It can take you 48 years or 47 years or 26 years and you can change it in 30 days. Boom, like that. So whoever is interested in changing your confidence from low to high, you just reach out to me and I'll point you to the right direction. And for everybody who is watching, I thank you so much. If you know somebody who can benefit from this talk, please share. And if you're watching a replay, put a replay. Ladies who want to have a private sacred space, join my group. I'll put a link. I wish you a beautiful, beautiful Sunday. My name is Monica Zampa and I send you so much love from Amsterdam. Bye.